Hello everybody, how you doing today? My name is Nick and welcome to my channel. Today I'm gonna to be watching WandaVision episode three. I really wanted to get this out as soon as I could, just like the first two episodes, just like I plan on doing every other episode. My earpods actually broke, had to get a new pair of headphones, so that is why this is going out later. But in terms of this episode, I really do not know what to expect. At the end of the second episode, we finally got color and now it seems like they're gonna be going into the 70s or the 80s decade. We also saw the beekeeper, I think that's what his name is gonna be, beekeeper guy, but he called out of the sewer and I wasn't really as shocked by that, but like I'm assuming there's some plot with him that's gonna be relevant later on in the story. But I'm loving this show. I love family sitcom styles and the fact that it's Marvel just makes me more intrigued because I know that it's gonna be something mind blowing at the end. It has to be, it's Marvel. So we're just gonna stop talking, we're gonna get into it. WandaVision episode three. I've also been watching some other like reviews and reactions to the first two episodes and I did not even notice that like, I think their name is Sword, but there's like a pattern with the sword, so I don't know if that's gonna come into big play later or not, but I'm assuming. Oh yes, like a 70s intro. <laughs> Aw, is this episode, she's not gonna have the baby this episode, I don't think. It's gonna be like prep for the baby. Aw. Yep, definitely <laughs> pregnant. Oh, their whole house looks so beautiful though in color. Like that staircase too. So great. You were at about four months now. Is that right? <laughs> <laughs> Hypothetically speaking, what size fruit would it be at, say, 12 hours? On vacation this afternoon. Oh, have a nice holiday. Hey, <laughs> up. Hey, buddy. Oh, what are you doing? Hey, up. Think you might have taken the head strumming a little too far there, old chum. Whoa, no. You've got oh. bigger. Have I? That's why. I can't see. You're an expert already. We've got nothing to worry about. Well, nothing to worry about outside of morning sickness, mood swings, aching back and f <gasps> Oh, did I do that? I didn't mean to. Oh, oh darling. Oh. Did the baby do that? <laughs> oh, actually, I never even considered that, but the baby has to have powers, right? Billy? Yeah. Well, I was thinking Tommy. Just a nice, classic, all-American name. Oh, mm, Tommy. Then there's Billy. <laughs> Well, we ought to decide soon. I estimate the baby's due. Biddy. Tommy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's due Friday afternoon. In three days? <gasps> what is happening with the time? Oh! Done? Ooh! Also known as false labor. Usually starts in the third trimester. <sighs> Named after John Braxton Hicks in 1875. <laughs> 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 Oh, and maybe it is her, like just with her pregnancy, her powers are going out of control. Stopped. <laughs> Do these earrings make me look fat? Oh, is that Dolly? Oh, thank God. <laughs> We've been having, it seems the people of Westview are always on the verge of discovering our secret. This room is a hard dinner. Yeah, there's something definitely strange going Something's on. Something's wrong here, Wanda. Yes, I know what you mean. We just don't know what to See, expect. this happened twice now. Is it just showing alternate, like, timelines or something? This time stuff is really, <laughs> really messing with my mind. The timing's between yeah, the, the baby's the coming. Could be quite <laughs> yeah, it's gotta be her. It's gotta be because of her labor. Just making her powers randomly come out. <laughs> <laughs> a little ending. Oh. Yes, dear? I think my water just broke. Oh, yes, dear. that's why they did that. Is this just showing like a random commercial? Hydra soak. Find the goddess within. Oh, Hydra. See, they keep doing so many just... In the first one, we got Tony Stark. Then we got the Hydra watch. Now we got the Hydra soap. <laughs> Damn, the phones are down too. I better run. Except he might have already left for vacation. <laughs> oh, Elizabeth Olsen, I don't know. I really, really like her performance in this. Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought the baby was in there. Wanda, what's up? Just stay right there. I think I might have a bucket in the kitchen. Oh, 
Okay, then. <gasps> oh. <laughs> that, that looks really nice. <laughs> a question for you oh no <laughs> you gotta leave temp job, right? she's going to labor crazy yesterday 10 minutes before the big presentation and mr haddix has got nothing. what did she turn him into oh he's is. still right there filing cabinets and jumping out when he least expects it like <laughs> what was that did you did you hear that no i'm helping mr haddix do a handstand under the water cooler vision needs to come back quick but he needs to be in his regular face he can't be in his vision face oh oh is that what i think it is oh a rib oh. <laughs> It's coming. Mr. Vision. Well, is everything okay with the wife? Yes. So long as we hurry. What about the super speed? I'm so confused. I thought they were trying to hide their powers from everyone, unless with him it's okay. <laughs> yes, you can. You can do this. Oh, there it is. It's done. Well, now which name is it going to be <laughs> if it's a boy? You both want different names. We went so fast, it was like we were flying. <laughs> well, don't you want to meet your son as yourself? <laughs> That's a beautiful moment. Tommy? Aw, he settled on her name. Yes, Tommy. <laughs> she has a second? What? 20 fingers and 20 toes. You've got two healthy baby boys on. Well, Dr. Nielsen, I hope you're still able to make your trip. Small towns, you know, so hard to escape. What did he mean by that? Howdy, neighbors. Howdy. Oh, there she is. <laughs> I was wondering where she would show up. Oh, yeah, okay. Something's definitely going on now. Is Geraldine inside with Wanda? Yes, why? You're such a strong lady. I had a brother. The first Avenger to His actually die. She knows him, doesn't she? Oh. What? What? He was killed by Ultron. <gasps> Wasn't he? Oh, she knows. You no know, family. Oh. Everyone's like living in this bubble. Except for her. Except for Geraldine. What did you say? Just now. I said... Oh, dang it, now she goes back to normal. What did you say about Pietro? Pietro? I think you should leave. Oh, Wanda, don't be like that. <gasps> what do you mean? She's part of the, like, sword group. She came here because we're all... She came here because we're all what? What are you trying to tell me? Oh, stuff's going down right now. Now it's going down. Came here because we're all- Stop it! Come on, say it, say it! Come on. Who are you? Wanda. Well, I better get going. Oh. Catch you on the flip side, bitch. Oh, it's, oh, it's so upsetting. I want all the episodes right now. She had to rush home. Did she kill her? <laughs> yeah, so it is like a little controlled world then. Wow. Okay. So they're like fencing people out. Okay, okay, guys. So that was the end of episode three of WandaVision. Wow, this show, first of all, the acting from Elizabeth Olsen in this, especially, I thought was superior to other two episodes. I don't know. I thought she had a couple emotional scenes, even with Vision. 
I thought their acting was so much better in this episode, I don't know why. But also their house looked amazing, I loved that. But besides those two things, I guess the main part of the episode was obviously the last 10 minutes. I, I, I don't know. I mean, it could be that my, my two theories are, one, it's an alternate timeline, like we're experiencing the multiverse right here, and it's all going to connect together, hopefully by the end. The second theory I have, which maybe is a little bit far-fetched, but maybe she is from the real world, and what they're living in right now is just a like controlled world because so many of the neighbors and everybody they act so weird like so different sometimes like they were about to tell vision the their neighbors and then all of a sudden they just don't and same with geraldine like i don't know i feel like there's a lot that they just cannot say and it will make sense in the future episodes but what a cliffhanger like i want to see the whole show right now but i i'm happy we at least got something in this episode where like it really makes me feel now like what this story is actually to be about yeah i'm so excited to see what the next episodes entail but hopefully you guys enjoyed this reaction and i'll see you guys in my next reaction which actually will be tomorrow so you guys will see another movie reaction from me tomorrow